Caribbean anoles that I research are a classic example of adaptive radiation. And that is when one single species rapidly gives rise to numerous ecologically diverse descendants. One of the remarkable things about anoles in the Caribbean is that they're not just found at sea level where we'd expect to see tropical lizards. They're actually found all the way up to the tallest peaks of the mountains. And it gets really cold up there. And what I discovered was that they weren't actually physiologically adapted to the cold. Instead, they were using their behavior to seek out climates that essentially reminded them of the warm habitat where their ancestors derived from. At high elevation, they've now become boulder-dwelling or saxicolous lizards, and that has been accompanied by its own suite of morphological specializations. For example, these lizards are essentially flattened. They're more dorsoventrally compressed. They have flatter heads. These lizards don't just perch on boulders for warmth. They retreat under them when threatened by predators and they sleep under them at night. So the same behavioral shift that slows the rate of physiological evolution actually exposes them to selection and accelerates morphological evolution.